the e Rebo. The monster Mamba conversion. Running two two cell lipos. And uh, I'm still running, so let's keep going. <laughs> There's another backflip for you. And I think we're done. So, there's a Revo. It'll be a little hard to see in the shade here. But, let's see. Ugh. It's pretty dirty. Got a lot of dust on it. Nothing too crazy. Let's have a look. Mamba. I wonder if I can get these pins out. Oh shit, looks like I lost one. No big deal. So, there's your Mamba motor. Not too hot. Uh, it's pretty hot, but not too hot. And there's the Traxxas uh, uh, equivalent ESC. It's not the Mamba ESC, but um, it runs great, especially on you know just this is just running two two cell lipos. So on two threes, I mean, I would have to completely replace the drivetrain with you know more steel or aluminum or whatever. Um, yeah, but overall, I mean, this thing is fantastic. Um, I haven't clocked it yet, uh, but I imagine on two two cells stock gearing, it'll probably do about 50-ish, I'd imagine. I have a rustler as well that I run a three cell on. Um, that'll do about 70. I could do some videos on that in the future. Um, but yeah, just got a little cleanup to do. Um, nothing major some dust, some dirt, to be expected, Mamba Motors, not too hot, but uh, yeah, good truck, great truck overall, I've had this thing for a while, it was a stock E-Revo before the brushless models came out, and I recently did a um, Mamba conversion on it, um, which has been fantastic, um, go ahead and cut it off there. running these which I wasn't too f I wasn't too fond of them fond of them to begin with but these uh, electron uh, batteries which I run in some of my quads um, seem to be doing really well in this machine uh, giving me all the power that I could expect out of a couple of two cell lipos um, but uh, yeah I'm not the best driver but uh, it's a hell of fun so uh, I'll post this as soon as I get a chance and uh, keep you guys updated. Great truck there. See my dirty body there. I'll have to clean it up before I bring it inside before the wife has a fit. But, anyways, there you go. The Revo, E Revo, converted to brushless. Not sure where I lost that body clip. Somewhere, in a flip somewhere, I'm sure. But uh, yeah, so there you go. Pretty cool machine. Take it easy. I'll back. Pow. One other thing, one last thing. Uh, I'm recording with a GoPro uh, Hero 3 Silver, I think. Um, you can see from the videos, we had a couple of. Uh, crashes into the GoPro, GoPro is fine, um, and uh, yeah, I'm running the 2.4 gigahertz system, um, as far as the uh, transmitter goes on the on the Revo, you can see from the short antenna there, um, but yeah, <laughs> GoPro, a um, couple crashes, <laughs> As you have seen on the videos, uh, but like I said, gotta clean it up for the wife. 
you know, freaks out. And um, these uh, these Talon, I think is what they're called, Talon tires uh, that come with the stock uh, Erevo, I mean, perform really well in dirt, as you've seen in the in some of those, some of that field right there on grass and uh, in asphalt. Uh, on asphalt right there we did a uh, kind of got a makeshift ramp there though i just kind of threw some crap together um but yeah it's uh it's pretty quick what i would really like to do is i don't know if you can see this or not um run my rustler if i could get a driver against my uh my bmw um 335i um i'll be ordering a an M3 in January of this upcoming year, um, but I think the Rustler can do uh, 60 in about three seconds with the setup that I have. So um, this is the Sport, uh, the M Sport 335i. But uh, yeah, if I can find a driver for either the car. The RC car or the, the car itself, um, which I would uh, I don't really trust anyone on either. Um, I'd like to get like a drag race going between this Erevo with the with the Mamba conversion as well as my Rustler, which is a lot faster. Um, and I run a single three cell on the uh, on the Rustler, but that'll come later. So you guys have a good one. Peace.